our last problem here, um, solving this oxidation reduction reaction in acidic solution. So remember, in acidic solution, we have a lot of H+, plus, we have a lot of water. So let's go ahead and balance this. What I see here is we have I2 going to I-, minus. we're just breaking this apart now. And um, so balancing the I's, that gives us two I's, and then balancing the charge, it will be 2E-, minus. so minus 2, minus 2, 2I, two 2I. Two all right, that seems pretty simple enough. This is an acidic solution, remember? That's what the problem tells us. It's an acidic solution. And so now we have S2O3 minus 2 to S4O6 minus 2. Let's uh, go ahead and balance the sulfurs here. 2 times 2 sulfur is 4 sulfurs. 2 oxygens, ta excuse me, 2 times 3 is 6 oxygens, 6 oxygens, and uh, minus, 2 times minus 2 is minus 4, and this is minus 2, so we have minus 4 charge, minus 2 charge, so it looks to me like um, we add a 2E minus here. Uh, interestingly, interestingly enough, uh, we don't really need to add any H+, plus. we don't need to add any water, Okay, even though this is an acidic solution, part uh, E here, this is an, an acidic solution, we don't really need to add any water, we don't need to add any H+. Plus. Uh, this, uh, um, this really is convenient for us. Uh, 2E minus 2E minus cancels, and the balanced chemical equation is 2S2O3 minus 2 plus I2 goes to S, um, goes to 2I minus four O six minus two. Okay, let's double check and make sure everything is okay now. Uh, two I two I is good. Four sulfurs four sulfurs is good. Six oxygens six oxygens is good. Now we got to balance the charge here. Minus four two times minus two is minus four. Minus two minus two is minus four. So this is the balanced chemical equation here. We really didn't have to split this into um, type of redox reaction. We didn't really have to split this up into a reduction half reaction of two electrons or an oxidation half reaction. This is a loss of two electrons. Uh, we could have just balanced it straight up. So, um, yeah.